Hi everyone, it's me Lina again. Welcome to my YouTube channel and thank you for checking my videos out. And today in this video I would like to make a review on a movie called Deadly Illusions. I recently watched it on Netflix and really enjoy watching it and I just want to share with you my experience of watching it, my opinion on it and so on. I must warn you that this video may contain some spoilers so if you don't want me to spoil anything for you it's better for you not to watch this video. This video is rather for people who already watched this movie and want maybe to discuss it or just to hear about it again and so on. So yeah. Gotta say that I actually really liked the movie. I think it is very nicely made. I think creators did a very good job and it is the type of the movie I would usually pick to watch. But there was a huge factor of why I was looking forward for this movie. So my oh one of my favorite actresses is in it. I wanted to say my favorite actress, but let's better say one of my favorite you know actress was in it. Our actresses and I mean I really enjoyed watching it, that's why, but not only. Meaning I think that movies were entertaining. It is easy to watch but it is a thriller psychological thriller, the type of the movie, as I said, I would usually watch, so that um, genre is not new for me and uh, this is type of movie I would enjoy watching it and would, you know, recommend and so on quite often. I think it is mostly about relationships, emotional, you know, um, scenes and let's say personalities, you know different people and how they interact, maybe about obsession I would say, some sort of that sort of scenes, you know, and gotta say that I think actors did very well in general, creators did well, they also made or created this beautiful atmosphere, well, not all of it was beautiful, some of it was actually creepy, but it was supposed to be like that, Lots of, or oh, not lots, but few beautiful locations were present in the movie, which I liked. And let's talk about Christine Days. I think she is very talented, very beautiful lady. And actually, if you, you know, would Google about her, you know, since about her, you can find out that she is very kind person too, generous, I would say, and yeah. I think that she's just amazing, but I want to discuss her performance in this movie. I think she did so well and I got to say that I noticed some face expressions that she used in lots of movies and TV shows, but I think that it is still a benefit and something that she owns so well, meaning that not everyone has it, not everyone is capable of such emotional uh, face expressions and in my opinion you know it's still rather something so great about actor or actress and so on in general I really enjoy it and I recognize those face expressions they are now very you know something that I really like and I need to say that they make uh, those moments in the movie more human like and more realistic that makes it incredible and makes a movie more watchable too, I think, more, you know, honest, I don't know how to say, more realistic actually, that would be the better word to use. So I really like it, I think her, you know, face expressions are very expressive, yeah, I don't know how else to say it and this is something that definitely you know, is memorizing, meaning uh, you would remember those scenes, you would remember certain, you know, smiles, certain, you know, I mean, different, you know, those face expressions, and yeah, I think I recognize this actress by that too very well, and yeah, definitely I like it a lot. But few few actors and few actresses have that scene. I noticed that and uh, some of it 
is actually I suppose like their main or one of their main you know maybe not skills probably but since that you would recognize them by and so on so it's um, amazing and I think it is a good scene rather so most actors as I said uh, seem to do very well also the actress who played Grace is very attractive I thought so she is definitely very eye-catching I liked her outfits too I got to be honest so yeah well the movie is about um, relationships about daydreams and maybe some nightmares too let's put it this way if to make it if to talk about details too also i like how they kept intrigue till the end even though i'm not sure if i liked the end that much but i thought that it wasn't like super different or you know i expected something like that so yeah let's put it this way but still they kept the intrigue i think they did well the creators and yeah i liked it quite liked it maybe the end i want it a little bit different but i mean it's just my opinion so yeah also i need to say that they made it uh, look like firstly that uh, the author the writer the lady the character of uh, christine davis was maybe somehow involved in something global in some way in the movie but uh, I suppose it was made to confuse us slightly to keep the intrigue and so on to make it you know like explosive you know meaning like to show us no it's not like that because they were uh, showing some daydreams of hers and uh, some nightmares she had while asleep and so on so it was interesting all in general I like movies like that also they showed lots of casual situations and I like that in movies it just shows important scenes and other scenes that are not that important they show as casual and I like it as routine for example someone is cooking in the kitchen but they are thinking they are thinking about someone or they are just concentrating on learning something about someone for example looking when looking at someone cooking you know or something like that I like scenes like that and again you know I like movies like that so it's my type of movie I like how sometimes it goes very slowly so yeah definitely this is the way I like it I definitely can recommend this movie to you to my friends and relatives I think that it deserves uh, your attention and also I thought that you know it's about you know maybe um, some I'm not sure how to say some wishes we have sometimes some uh, dreams or uh, expectations you know and maybe um, some hidden desires and so on it's interesting and um, I like movies about human beings about their emotions their feelings and so on so yeah it's um the movies that you need to watch attentively gotta say that in the end i wasn't very attentive but through most of it i was like super attentive because i just loved it i was looking forward for it and so on so let me know what you think maybe you think differently or maybe you just want to know more what i think about that and details or situations and so on i thought that movie is good and just uh, well entertaining you know so on my rating from 1 to 10 I would give this movie around um, 10 stars out of 10 because it totally deserves it and yeah honestly I wish there were more movies with Christine Dex <laughs> Let me know what you think and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, give this video thumbs up. I'll see you soon. Wow.